Alrighty guys, in today's video we're going to be looking at the file parameter settings um, for TrueCut already works. We're also going to be looking at the first um, setting within these parameters. But before that, let's have a quick intro first. So today's video can be found on softwaretraining.co.za we make short and easy to watch problem solving videos and we also have daily updates otherwise back in the program here now this is going to be a mini series on the file parameter settings or file para settings as it is called and we're also going to be looking what is contained within it what do these values do and what is um perhaps with some of them what is good values to set to now first of all to locate this uh the, the file para settings or parameter settings we want to go to our main menu on top and we go to config and then you'll see here under the second one there is file para settings if we click this it will open the dialog box with all the settings now first off on the list here we've got the plt format precision so this is for importing files as we can see that and then um yeah we've got uh two defaults 10 16 or um, 1000 and then what this will do is if you want to make sure your uh, plt files is very accurate within the program then what you want to do is there where you've exported them from so the program you've made them in so your plotter file you want to make sure what is it setting and then set it accordingly so we've got two defaults but you can also set it to whatever you want let's say you wanted to make it 10 15 Okay, then press enter like me it's just click out the box and then it will save those settings for you you can just click ok when you're done so you can also set this to whatever you want but uh, in general the defaults will also be good but like i said just keep in mind wherever you've exported your plt from um, just make sure what its precision settings is there but otherwise yeah that is it on the plt precision um, if we had to head to the website softwaretraining.co.za you guys will notice we've got a variety of different softwares we do cover and also you can isolate your search on the top right if you do not however find the training videos you're looking for just go here request a training video fill in the mini form let us know for which software and then we'll do our best to try and make that video for you but otherwise thanks guys for watching and cheers